this week on the Hoover Boys. Oh, Brad's working up here on the beach. And there's just some tasty numbers. I have no idea what it is, but I worked down to it. You're, you're deep. Oh, let's get some wake up in here. <laughs> See, let me get over here. Yeah, I'm right on it. <laughs> of course, a boat just went by. Okay, yeah, I just, yeah, I got it. Ready? Really Ready? Yeah, it does. Oh, oh is it black? <laughs> well, our buddy Chris is in town, the 44 guy, and uh, we're going to go in the water and have some fun today. <laughs> and we have a little game to play as well. Josh DeHanica sent us a Pennsylvania lottery scratch-off ticket, $20 ticket, and whoever finds the oldest identifiable coin today gets to scratch it, and hopefully it's a winner. I already won that game. <laughs> he won 30 bucks on a, a three, $3 ticket this morning. It's the biggest winner I think I've ever had. <laughs> <laughs> I believe it. So we're waiting for Brad and Mark to get here. I think Steve and Ron will be meeting up with us later. If they get off work, we're going to have some fun and save some history. Yeah. Got to ring the bell for good luck. Let's go. Hey, buddy. What up? I got your signal. I got your signal right here too. <laughs> Chris was working on the mid ten. The tide was pulling him away, so I, I came out here and dug it out. It's a gold button. <laughs> it looks so unbelievably gold. <laughs> Look at that thing, man. <laughs> it's it's not gold. It just looks like it has been beaten around in a river. Isn't that beautiful? <laughs> Let me see. <laughs> you gotta you gotta keep it over top of the floaties. <laughs> My button. <laughs> it's only like 20, 25 minutes per hole for me. <laughs> you'll you'll get your learn on, buddy. <laughs> I got a bunch of buttons so far, but I just pulled out a beautiful Indian. What are you filming? Indian. Eighteen eighty. That black on it. That is beautiful. You got a good one, Mark? No. I got, I got one of the lead bazingas. You got a lead bazinga? Yeah. Oh, it's well. My, uh, I got another uh, coin out of here. It's beeping at 65, so it's probably another Indian, but <laughs> it didn't look like this one. Uh, we're going to keep going. Right, Chris has got a couple buttons. Let me hold your hat. I'm trying not to film Mark, Here, but got, oh, yeah. Brad, Brad's about to go under for a signal because he can uh, set as a mid but he can't uh -huh. get in the scoop. So, good night. Entertainment. <laughs> Bye, Felicia. Here you go. <laughs> oh, Ty's got him now. How long do we give him before we search for him? I got a fishing weight. I see it in his hand. <laughs> oh, it's a nice weight. I just couldn't scoop it. Yeah, ah, that's because it's got the line on it. I had that happen to me earlier where I kept scooping it. When I bring it up, the fishing line will pop it back out of the scoop. That is the only way to do it. <laughs> that, that, was was, fun. that was fantastic. Good job. Well, I just came over to the boat to eat my lunch. And, of course, now Brad pulls out a coin of some sort. Papa? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Did you just hock a loogie on your coin? Don't get it wet. <laughs> don't get it. Don't get it don't wet. Get it <laughs> oh, it is a copper. Here, put it over here, buddy. Nice. Any deets? It's weird. Nice get your bone off. Don't <laughs> rub your bone on me. Get your bone away. Is it farther than that, Fred? No, it's no, a, it's a big. It, it's a it's a full here. half penny. <laughs> get the water to you. <laughs> Try to figure out if there's a wreath on this side or not. Can you stop moving the thing? You don't want me to drop this. It took him 20 minutes to get it out. 25. Good job, buddy. Thanks, man. You got some shoe buckle for image? Yeah. Let it ring up. That'll drop in there. What about nice. huh. this shoe buckle for image? We got more shoe buckle for images? No, that's like spectacle frame or something. Yeah, it's little stuff. Good job. Thanks, man. All right, I'm going to go back to eat my lunch.
I'll get you guys rubbing your bone on me. Looks like a fish hook, actually. <laughs> Mark's got a really nice button. It's an script die, War 1812. It's got the little circle with probably the regiment number or whatever underneath of it. That is awesome. That's a piece of history. <laughs> That's the good stuff. Nice work. Oh, yeah. Well, we got Ryan here now, and Steve, and Ross and his daughter, and Brad's diving down again. He says he's got a coin signal. <laughs> he can't get it in his scoop. <laughs> No, Brad, that's my Any way. guesses on what he's got here? <laughs> I, I say the D. Give him the D. He's upside down. Does the shark got him? I want to scoot over a little bit so he can kick me in my nose. <laughs> yeah, don't, don't kick me in my begonia. He's up. Did you got it? No, I had it and then it was gone. It's going to be harder this time because you don't have a coil on the soil. <laughs> He's gonna kick Chris in the face. <laughs> God, I hope he does. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. <laughs> oh, come on, get it. Got it? No. No! Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna have to get a beep on it again. That's all there is to it. Get a beep on it. Yeah. I, I have no idea where you was. <laughs> I just pulled that out before I came over here. And it is a memorial. Awesome. I got a memorial. This better be a coin. <laughs> yeah. uh -uh. Heard something that sounded coin like. Huh? <laughs> Once you're on it. Oh, that's a coin, bro. I know. That sounds good. <laughs> Alright, so let me get my foot on the top of your. Are you on it right now? Yeah. Okay, alright. You good? Yeah. That sounds, that's tight. Why does he get these signals? He's upside down again. Don't kick the camera. Or, or my, don't kick Marty. <laughs> Whoa, what is going on here? I'm getting attacked by a Japanese hornet. Please tell me you got it. I don't have to. Huh? I don't have anything. Can I scoop it up? Yeah, you can. Oh, Brad, let me uh, take two scoops and it's out, buddy. It's an 81 solid. Let me see. Can I see your shovel compared to mine? Is there a hole in mine? It, it, it's the same thing. It's, I got skills, Junior. It. It's right there. You see it? Yeah, it's a it's copper. Right it's right there. At least you didn't cut it in half. Yeah, I was working on this for 25 dog barking minutes. You weren't scooping deep enough, maybe. I got in there real deep, like. Anything? Yeah, what is it? Oh, there it is. That's you see it? One cent. Class. I see some stars. Okay, it's one cent. What a hacker. What a child. <laughs> what a hacker. What a garbage metal detectorist. <laughs> uh, I honestly not sure on this one. Besides it being a large cent. I got a leech in my ear canal. <laughs> you got a leech in your ear. Something's itching. And you got the two coppers. Unbelievable. I, I just sit there scooping, 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 scooping. In the bottom of the hole, yeah. the bottom of the hole, bottom of the hole, bottom. Push it, push it, push it, push it. It's fun. Yeah. Let's do some yeah, more. Certainly fun. So this is interesting. I had like a mid-tone thinking button. I kept scooping at it, wouldn't get in my scoop. Finally just put my probe in the water and grabbed it. It's a bottle. It still has the uh, the metal topper thing. That's what I was beeping on. It's a little topper. But it's from uh, Philadelphia, PA. That is sweet. It's got an American flag on it. That is a cool bottle. This is a really cool shade of purple too. I don't know how good it's showing up. That's a keeper. I've been waiting to find an old bottle in the river. Billy Boy's going to be jealous of that one. <laughs> is this the first time you've been back to Gold Beach? Your coin came out right there. Right. No, it was right, it was right there. What do you got in your hand, buddy? Uh, I was beeping on shore, and I didn't beep this, but... Is it a beepable target? I do it with my eyes. Oh! How cool is that? It's a shark tooth, isn't it? Yeah, it's, I think it's Get a Mako. Get out of here! I'm pretty sure it's a Mako. No, what? This <laughs> isn't... 
Bob's never getting in the water now. <laughs> I mean, this is petrified. I was, I was figuring you had an arrowhead, no, but I got, that's... I got that's, millions of years old, not yeah. thousands. Well, that's the oldest thing we found today. <laughs> that is awesome, man. All kinds of I haven't found a nice space. tooth in a while. That's a big one. Good job. Oh, Brad's working up here on the beach. And there's just some tasty numbers. I have no idea what it is, but I worked down to it. You're you're deep. Oh, let's get some really jumping. <laughs> See, let me get over here. Yeah, I'm right on it. <laughs> of course, a boat just went by. Yeah, yeah, I, just, yeah I got it. Ready? You ready? To ready? Yeah, it does. Oh, oh, is it black? You just got a two ELs. I don't know. I bet it is. It's black. What else would it be? You are just some sort of lucky today. Give me that. Give me my. It's a. It's a freaking big silver. You sure. It's gotta be. <laughs> this kid. <laughs> it's a deucer, man. Come on. Get off there. Take your gloves off and do it. Or is it a copper? Copper. It is a copper. It just looks black for huh. some reason. <laughs> KG3? I guess so. It's looking right. It's not a bad looking one. Yeah. So there we go. Let it focus in. My eyes are all messed up today. <laughs> I thought you had a deucer. Isn't that stupid depth though on a beach? Yeah. Well, it's all filled in now. That is awesome. Well, that's the oldest coin of the day so far, I believe. You got three coppers. You're just hogging them all today, aren't you? You got a big button? Big gold looking bud. I'm finding plenty of buttons and other things. Sweet. Good job. Thanks, man. Whew. Ah. I'm glad I came over and watched. That was fun. <laughs> you had me going. <laughs> Alright. Well, we've made it back to the guys. Perfect. We're going to see what uh, Ron found. Yeah. Is it silver? Yeah. Oh, you got Andy in. Nice. 67. That's a pretty one. <laughs> it knocked him off his feet. Yeah. That's how pretty it is. Semi key knockoff. Dude, that is beautiful. Oh, man. It doesn't look like a double stamp from no, the eyeball. I zoomed in on it. That is a nice one. Just the latest I got all day. Look at that thing. What? Yeah. Crazy, huh? Bob dropped that, didn't he? <laughs> <laughs> That'll confirm Bob not getting into this water at all. That's it. That is cool. Even if it was 40 million years ago. Alright, I think I'm going to go around the point. We need to get in the water over there. Alright, what, what, what's going on over here? Man, found his first half reality. Just found a... I'm out there neck deep. And you guys over here <laughs> with, with your ankles. Non underwater headphones. That's oh. our signal. We're on the same frequency. Let me turn my machine off. Alright. 1777. <laughs> Get out of here. Oh, no way. way. Dude. I had a bunch of crud on it. Focus. I thought it was a flat button breathe. at first. Focus, camera. Why are you so slow? I was going underwater for that one. There we go. 1777. King Charles III half for you. Your first beep. I'm up three buttons. Awesome. <laughs> Congrats. Thanks, brother. That's awesome. Your turn. I'm trying. <laughs> oh, man. It's been a while since I turned on the camera. I mean, we're, we're finding stuff here and there. Button here, button there. Nothing too crazy. I think there's another button here. It's stuck in the mug. Before we get it out together, it was like a 62. Yeah, it's a button. Button! Very cool. I've got a lot of buttons today been a button day for me. Eh, cool little back mark. Alrighty, it's getting dark. I took another step, got another mid-tone. Just a little buckle. Oh, that is beautiful. That's a knee buckle. It's gotta be a knee buckle. Oh, that is beautiful. Real small, you can see where the, the pin would run across it right there. I think I got a knee buckle. That is beautiful. Alright, I may have, I might be onto something. We're in an area we haven't been 
detecting a whole lot at today. So a button and a buckle. Hopefully the next will be a coin. Well, it's not a coin. I took another foot and I found another buckle that matches the last buckle I found, which is pretty crazy. It is the same knee buckle as the last. It's a little bent up, but we got a matching pair. That's freaking incredible. I'm all pruny. <sighs> well, it took all day. I got a silver. It looks like a dime. I lost it. I gotta find it again. Okay, it's over here. There it is. Little silver dime. Uh, yeah. I got a mark. I don't know if it's gonna focus on it. It's getting dark out here. Definitely a mark. My first mark out of the water. Uh, we'll have to check out the date later in the wrap up. Two targets. You got two targets? One scoop. Yeah? Yeah. Good job, buddy. I got a, a key. A key? And a 22 casing. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> I poked myself in the eye. My bloodshot. We, uh, we beeped until uh, 10 or so. I ended up getting a big dandy button in the dark and another Indian. That was fun. That was a fun filled day. Is this just me and Mark's drunk? Yeah, I'm not in there. You're not in there? You. We dug a lot of fish and say, look at that monster. <laughs> That's a three. <laughs> There's the board. Here is Ron. He got that beautiful 1867 Indian. Little button or so. Is this Chris up here? Chris got a bunch of little buttons. Oh, you got a little... That's probably off a little cuff. That's a pretty one. I like this one. Yeah, the one that looks gold. I love when they come out like that. Here's Mark. You got a nice thimble. Some buttons. GW button. That one being the best. The script eye. I'll say Brad for last, I guess. I got some doorknobs. <laughs> Colonial light switch. Big spoon bowl. Couple musky balls. I got on a bunch of buttons. That being it, that's the dandy I pulled out tonight. Here's my little buckles. Really nice. I thought these were a matching pair. They look the same, but the ones, <clears throat> the ones bigger than the other. And there's the two Indians in the Merc. Man, look at that thing sparkling. And there's the bottle. Cleaned out the Indian. bottle. It's nice. It's probably 1890s, turn of the century, 1900 or so. And uh, Brad got the oldest coin. He got the birdie thing. Is it like a flag top or something? Nah, maybe not. Shoe buckle frame edge. A couple buttons. He got on all the coppers. Whew. Oh no, what is that thing? <laughs> Off of me. He said it was a bird. The bird ate him. Oh. <laughs> We got on all the coppers. Uh, the the one earlier you said was like a 1910 classic head. 1810. 1810. I said 1910. I got the 1910. Yeah, he the 1910 lady. <laughs> That's the KG3. So he won the scratch off. We'll scratch that after this. And the oldest find of the day is absolutely the shark's tooth. Are you gonna scratch it with the KG3? Yeah, you absolutely. probably should. Until next week, help clean up the ground, dig it all, and take your trash with you. Why? All holes matter. That is correct. Alright, so we got a big money. Yeah, it is. Is. Here, well. Yes, idiot. Alright, you ready, buddy? This is big money bonus money. This is the, the Pennsylvania lottery ticket. Try again. Oh, why does it still gotta have a number there? Try again. Oh, you need the money. No bonus. No bonus. This scratch as well. Yeah. Thirty-seven. I can't see. I'm on the wrong side. 10, 20, 22, 4, 
8.36. Just give him a match. It's a $20 ticket. 26, 21, 19, 32. 27, 31, 28, 35. You're a loser. 23, I'm a huge loser. 23 is my number too, so if that didn't hit, then. 37, 13, 18, 6, 11, 1. one. I hate one. Well, we tried. Thank you very much for the ticket. She gone. Thanks, it was fun. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Your head is so red. <laughs> oh no! It's <laughs> a fight, man. <laughs> Man, I got up at 6.30, I didn't f*** with you once. He almost kicked me into pills. Yeah. <laughs> you ready to go digging? Hell yeah. Alright, let's go.